for calling the FBI. Can I have your first name, please? Yes. First name is David. And your last name? Uh, is it okay if I don't provide it? Yes. Thank you. Uh, your date of birth? Is it mandatory, please? No. Yep. Do you want to give your phone number? Four one. Is that a cell phone or a landline? A cell phone. Okay. Four one five five one eight six five two four. Is that correct? Yep. Okay, and I need your zip code. Nine four zero eight zero. I I'm like right now. I'm not at, at my place. I'm in another town. So, is that okay? okay that, nine yeah. Nine four zero eight four. No. Nine four zero eight four. Eight four. South San okay. Francisco. Yes. Nine four zero eight four. Yeah. Okay. I'm having a hard time hearing you. Are you, am I on speakerphone? Yes. Could you take me off, please? I'm recording it. I do not consent to be recorded. It is the public line, ma'am. Because, you know, I've been uh, treated really bad. That's why I'm trying to keep record of everything. I'm reporting some... I, I do not... I cannot consent to be recorded, so I'm going to end the call. Thank you for calling. Ma'am, you are the public servant, ma'am. You are the public employee. If I provide later or something like that. Yeah, I... Um, you mean you don't want to talk right now, or? Yeah, you know, I'd rather if everything is just put on record and, you know, every, like what we call, like that, I, I don't mind to give everything. Okay. Um, so do you want to give your contact number? Yes. I have two numbers. Is, okay. What's your date of birth? Do you want to give that? Mm, I don't want to make myself look old, so. <laughs> All right, just bear with me now. Yep. What city in the state do you live in? Sir? I'm in California. What city in California? Uh, right now, I don't live at home. I am on the street. So. Okay. Are you in any particular city, though? or? I am in South San Francisco. South San Francisco. Yes. Okay. Do you know the zip code in South San Francisco? We are the one involved. That's why I'm trying to reach the FBI. Okay, and you've called us before to report it? Yes. Okay. And the buzzer hang, hang, hung up on me hung up on me yesterday. The uh, You know, the agent hung up on me when I said, you know, this is happening like this. He was just like, what are you talking about hung up? They were, they were telling my wife and that, you know, she cannot contact me, cannot, cannot let me meet my child since April 28th and I cannot contact them I yes I cannot even contact where they are I cannot find out nobody can contact them even my parents her parents everybody's starting to worry because you know where they are and last week I found out so, a third so party your wife is not not allowing you to see your child they are, I don't know where they are at they she's uh, everybody tried to call her the phone is off there's no answer the phone was totally off and the police keep saying like you know and then last week we found, I found that somebody third party filed restraint third party filed restraining order on on her behalf so which is Against she you? yes which is she she doesn't have the ability she, i know that she, very well she doesn't have the capability to do anything and somebody else is doing all the court document on behalf of her and i'm like that's what i'm like trying to get Things, you know. Do you think she got an attorney to help her? No. Okay, well, that's really a local matter. I mean, that's, that's nothing um, that ma'am, uh, yes, I call, I call yeah. 911, and the same police department answered. They said, oh, you have the, yo, you want to talk, come to the station, we'll talk. The way they're doing, they, you know, these people, they, 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 they arrested me twice in one week, one month, for no apparent reason. And what, what was the charges? They said resisting arrest and obstruction of justice. I was in my own home. My wife, she does that all okay. the time. You know, uh, she, she take the child and then she, whenever we got financial hardship or anything like that, she'll take my son and she'll go. 
she 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 left like that twice already. This is the third time she did, but this time with the lockdown, she couldn't go anywhere, and I don't know how she ended up with the police. Yes. She left you two other times. Yes. She has left you two other times. Yes. Okay. Well, sir, uh, the best thing you could do is, I mean, are you married to her? Yes. Okay. Well, then you need to maybe seek some uh, legal. No, ma'am. Advice no, ma'am. I can't. No, they are. No, sure, not about custody. The custody, the court order already. The court order, whatever the what because the order? the police, the police in the middle doing everything. It's retaliation. They came up because they found out that I have lawsuit against the the, the police department. Okay, sir. Um, again, the thing uh, is, I'm concerned about my family, her, did my they wife. Order her? Did they did they order in, in favor of her to have custody? Or no, what? no. The thing is not about custody. I'm not worried about custody. Now, 42 days so far, today, until today is 42 days, nobody know where they are. Mm -hmm. Okay. What, what is it that you're calling about? What is your concern then? If Missing. That, I don't know. I'm, I'm concerned Just about... location, finding out where they're at? I don't know what happened to them. Nobody know what happened to them. That's all I, I, I know. And, you know... Uh, her mother cannot contact her. My parents contact cannot contact her. Every relative like telling me like you know they will find out, find out. I don't know where to find them. And I call the police and the same police Lawsuit. department against this police department. What what state are you in again? California. California. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you could reach out to the California State Attorney General and see if they can assist you. Ma'am, this is about safety and my child's well-being. I'm asking for help. Okay, sir, it's not, it's not an FBI matter. I'm sorry. So the, the police commit crime. If the police commit crime, anything like that, also nothing wrong with the, the, the FBI not doing anything? You, you, can, you can follow a uh, complaint with the state attorney general. Already did. The police department. Already did. The internal affairs department. Ma'am, I did the internal affairs retaliation. Right away it came up. Twice, yes. Of justice and and second time is that there. second time they said, okay, you know, we, you want to file complaint, come here, then you know, we took interview. And once they were talking, and later on they, they put me in handcuff and they uh, they tried to put me in the what they call mental institution for seventy two hours. And got to the hospital, the dog was nothing is wrong. What are you? Why why are you? They send you. Why do they send you here? Go home. Okay, so that's that's what they did. They arrested you and took you to the hospital for a seventy two hour evaluation. Yeah, but the over the less than two hours, the doctors said nothing is wrong with this guy. You know, you just go home, and they send me home. Okay. Well, they they can, you know, if they deem oh. it necessary, they can do that. They can send oh. you to the hospital, sir. But I mean, and I understand they they released you, and that's good. No, I mean, uh, so the police can do whatever they want, and they can get away. Nobody can do anything. The FBI cannot going to do anything. I mean, you know, it is violation so what here I'm, on what the. I'm telling you is that that particular. For that particular complaint, you would need to go through the state. Of yes, state I already did. I already did. Their internal, and their internal affairs department. Ma'am, I did. I did. Otherwise, I won't call FBI. Okay. I, I ran out of sources. Okay, I, there's, I, I ran out. I can document this, sir, but I can't guarantee that there's anything we can do. So if my, child, if, my, agent, if my wife and child, them, if my agent. wife and child are missing and the police did something and nobody going to investigate and nothing wrong, I, how am I going to do How am I going to find them? Who is going to investigate? Well, maybe you can hire a private investigator, sir. So FBI, yeah, even sure. though my wife is murdered, my child is murdered, who's going to do anything? This is what FBI did. Okay. 